there and welcome to Legal Break. I'm Maureen Akers and with me today, Gary Bruce. As always, Gary, thank you so much for joining us again. Thank you, Maureen. Good to be here again. Well, 4th of July is right around the corner. A lot of folks are going to be celebrating either boating or using fireworks. Um, can you ha do you have any legal advice for those of us um, that might be doing either one or the other? Well, <laughs> I read that this is the most dangerous holiday. Which really? co should come as no surprise wow. to anybody. Yeah. You know, we're dealing with outdoor activities. Uh, and the most dangerous things that happen, frankly, are car wrecks, uh, drinking and driving issues. Those mm -hmm. kind of things are at a high level this week, this coming weekend and mm -hmm. into the week. The, uh, there's firework injuries. Yeah. Those are, we see primarily with the eyes, you yeah. know, and hands and, hands. and fingers. Yeah. So to children a lot of times, which is kind of scary. Mm -hmm. and and then there's the uh, swimming and those kind of safety, boating safety, you know, mm -hmm. use the life jacket. Mm -hmm. uh, and then food poisoning's a big deal, I read. Oh, wow. Yeah, we see that. So uh, you gotta be careful. Can't let the mayo sit out too long, right? right? Or don't <laughs> undercook the, yeah, the, the, the meat, chicken. so, yeah. right. So, so th it's just a time to be safe and think about yeah. things and don't get careless. Well, now, are there age requirements um, for purchasing fireworks? Yeah, we talked about states. this at the beginning of the year. Georgia changed some of their laws, yeah. and there is a lot more exposure and availability of fireworks in Georgia now. Mm -hmm. So, but you have to be 18 to buy okay. uh, fireworks, mm -hmm. and then you're supposed to be 18 to set them off. Mm -hmm. And then, uh, surprisingly, this is I found this interesting. It, fireworks can be used from 10 a.m. to 12 midnight most days, but on the Fourth of July and New Year's. They extend it to 2 a.m., okay. which I hope nobody near me is listening <laughs> right. to. You know, I don't want to hear it at 2 a.m. In Alabama, you can buy fireworks at 16. Mm -hmm. uh, a little different, uh, just a, an example of different states have different laws about right. these things. Right. So, you know, those are the things you worry about, the fireworks and the safety related to the fireworks and keeping children away from them and educated about the danger. Yeah, absolutely. So now, if you happen to be involved in an accident where fireworks or a boat are involved, what should you do? To possibly, I guess, possibly collect any damages or well, make sure you're taken care of? Like any case, you know, first get yourself treated, take mm -hmm. care of yourself, uh, take care of the medical situation. And if somebody's responsible, if somebody acted negligently, if somebody wasn't taking care of things properly, mm -hmm. then they may have exposure and you could talk to somebody about, talk to a lawyer about what your rights are. Right. Right. But uh, let's hope there's not any of that. Exactly. Let's all be careful. <laughs> let's enjoy the 4th of July. and uh, Maybe this year will be the um, safest holiday, the safe, right? <laughs> the safest holiday. We want it to be that. So right. thank you so very much for joining us today, Gary, thank on Legal you. Break. And we look forward to seeing you on the very next one.